Welcome to Every Man's Audio Video Card Diary. My name's Chris. This is my YouTube channel. I haven't been on here in months, if not if not years. So. Uh, today we're going to talk about the Chrysler 200. I've driven a couple of them now for about a week at a time. Uh, the first one I drove was the 200S, which is the all-wheel drive powered by the great Pentastar V6. And then the second one I drove was a uh, 2.4 liter Tiger Shark engine. It's a 200 Limited. Um, between the two, as a car guy, the 200S is way more fun, but the price is in the mid to upper 30s. The 200 Limited, which we're sitting in today, priced at about $26,000, and as a point A to point B commuter car, it's great. And I will tell you, it can hold three kids. Um, your oldest has to be at a booster seat or about out of that toddler seat, and then a baby carrier um, can fit all three in the back. I didn't have any time to take pictures of all three of them in there because when you have three boys, it's hard to keep a handle on them even when they are strapped in the seats. But they fit. Uh, the car itself is 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 great. Um, the plastics don't feel cheap like the old uh, Chrysler's and Dodge. It's it's the more modern plastics that we're getting from from overseas with the Italians and when the Fiat ownership. The the nickname of the 2.4 liter engine, the Tiger Shark, it's great. Uh, as a four cylinder goes, it it has some grunt down low. There's so much more torque down low that you don't feel like you're driving a four cylinder engine. And and to be honest. If I had to drive it fast on a racetrack, I'm sure then I would find that it's completely underpowered, but I never drive it on a racetrack, I just drive it around town. Uh, and even trying to save on fuel economy a little bit, it, it does really well um, with feeling like it has enough power. It doesn't really do that great on fuel economy. Um, I did run over uh, to a neighboring town, about 20 miles away or so on the highway, uh, and I, I, I kind of got 26, 27. Uh, every day and, and, and kind of city traffic. If I'm good on it, I get about 22. If I use my foot a little bit, it's about 19. Um, all in all, I, I really like it though. I still fill up the same amount of times, like it's been about a week and so I would have to fill up again at about a week, which is what I have to do with my, my normal daily driver. But you don't put as much gas into this. You're gonna, you're gonna put less gas into it. So yeah, you're saving money, but you're not getting, I, I never saw a 30, I never saw a 30. Um, it's a good car though, I like this one a lot. The 200S um, is the more passionate, more alive car. I loved hammering that thing around town, um, and I, I did hammer that thing around town. I did not, I, whatever fuel economy I got in that, I, it doesn't matter, because that car is fun to drive, and that's why I wanted to drive it, and it was great. Um, so, if you're in the market for a Camry, an Accord, an Altima, oh Jesus, if you're looking at an Altima, please come look at a Chrysler 200. I'm sorry, Nissan, um, your CVT drives me insane. It's a good CVT, but it drives me insane. Um, you have a nine-speed gearbox in this, which is awesome. Um, in town, you only really see seventh gear at the top, and on the highway, you can get up into eighth and ninth. The shifting isn't that noticeable to me. It's it's pretty good. There is no manual mode in the 200 Limited. There is a manual and, and sport driving mode in the 200S, um, which allowed me to have way more fun. So. If you're in the market for a small sedan, please go look at the 200s. They're way better than they used to be. They look fantastic. They have F-Type-esque taillights now, which I think look great. It's It's been a fun car. Now, even, even with three kids, it's usable. My wife didn't hate it. It's usable. So, go give it a look. That's all I got time for, and Hopefully I get something else to drive. So send me cars, companies that send cars, please. <laughs> Thank you guys, hope you enjoyed it. Click subscribe if you want to. If you don't, um, have a good day. If you leave nasty comments, again, have a good day. I don't care, you're the internet. You're the internet, you're gonna be hateful no matter what. So peace out, see you guys later, bye-bye.